I've been coaching here at the Vancouver Skating Club for 25 years and um, my job is to develop young skaters from the early stages of learn to skate right to a competitive international elite level. From my experience with figure skaters, as they, because they're so passionate about what they do, the dedication required to really become a competitive figure skater is such a commitment and they love it so much that they become very organized with their schoolwork, they're disciplined with their training, they are able to take those skills that they need to have to be this committed every day at the rink to their life beyond skating. They generally are fairly successful in their abilities beyond skating because of those skills that they've learned. I'm 19 years old right now and I've been skating for I have to believe 14 years, figure skating for 10 years. So I first played hockey and then went into skating after that. Each week is uh, very grueling. It's, um, I'm there at the rink five days a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And I train off the ice almost every day of the week, other than Sunday. Um, at the rink, I'm on the ice for about two and a half to three hours a day. And then I do about an hour of off ice each day. So it's quite, it's about 20 hours a week, 25 hours a week of oh yeah, grueling training. <laughs> To learn a new routine, a uh, short program, it takes about a week. But then to master it, <clears throat> to get the choreography right, to get it how the choreographer wants it to be, it takes about six months. So we train it for about six months before we first do it in competition. Sure. Well, um, well, I started out as a single skater, and I still do. And then um, Shane was skating, and he needed help with his dances, and he needed a partner. So they asked me if I could partner him, and then they asked us eventually if we wanted to skate together. Oh. And so then we became to I started skating, I used to play hockey. And then my mom put me and Liam in figure skating to get better at skating. And then we both liked it more, so we just picked that one over hockey. Yeah. Um, skating, well, it's kept me in shape, and that's good. Uh, also, just like, it gives you uh, something, like, makes you determined and gives you a drive, and that's always good to have in life. It gives you a lot of discipline which is really good to have. And then just being so active all the time, you're fit and you know how to use, like you've used muscles that you would never use before and you have flexibility and all the cardio training and so you're just really healthy. Uh, my high moments right now I'd say is my skate last year at the 2011, B or 2011 Canadian National Championships. I placed sixth in senior men, but my first year, so I'm, I was really happy about that. The year before, I'd say it's, it's on par with my skate last year. I was junior national champion of Canada and skated very well, but last year I think just topped it. I was extremely happy and it was a great national championship for my first senior men's debut. Um, um, some proud moments in skating is definitely getting the opportunity to go to Italy and compete for Canada in Junior Grand Prix. And just being at nationals and being, last year we were fourth in Canada, so it just feels really good to be like pretty close to the top and just getting the opportunities. Uh, I love skating because I've done it for so long and it's like, it's like walking, like I can do it so easily and it's just in me since I was little. And I just love just gliding and being with a partner is so much fun because you can always joke around and and laugh and then you can be sad together or any emotion and it's like having Funny another girl. best friend. Skating is it's a big part of Canada you know there's hockey hockey and figure skating are two big sports in Canada and everyone has to try it I think who lives in Canada and if you don't like it that's okay but at least give it a try. As most people probably know when you watch figure skating on television it's, it requires an extreme amount of athleticism but even casual skating is great exercise, it, 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 it improves your strength, your core, your stamina, your balance, your agility. So, you know, casual skating on a, on a regular basis is a great way to stay in shape and to enjoy your fitness and give yourself that change of pace from sitting on a treadmill or sitting on a recumbent bike or stepping on the treadmill every day.